-hmm. Writing extra. Okay, I put my homework. Mm -hmm. And probably I mean, if there is some writing involved here, because I want to spend the time in class to correct and to teach you how to write. But I first I want you to give it a try. You understand? Okay. Mm -hmm. First I want you to write and I want to correct your your mistakes and on we're going to work based on your mistakes. Okay. Okay? Okay. So um writing extra, travel guide. Number one. Work with a partner and answer the questions. A have you ever 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 been to any of the cities in the photos? Buenos Aires, Dublin, Sydney, Madrid, Amsterdam. B what do you know about them? I've never been in these cities. <laughs> Not even one of them? No, Buenos Aires, no. No, no, no. And this is, if I'm not mistaken, I think I've been there. In, what's the name of that street? Like, uh, very traditional? <laughs> yeah. La Boca. La Boca? No. Boca. No. Boca, no. No. Um, Are the people dance tango yeah. and say a, a person? I've been there. Why you you stay there and you don't remember? I've <laughs> been there. But. Oh my God, I forgot. But it's it's pretty much like it's like an old neighborhood like La Victoria but everything is colorful and it's like they could do that in Lima they could transform La Victoria like that because mm -hmm. it's pretty much the same like you see all like houses like very traditions and all houses and but cultures yes that would be probably Barranco right I think more but Barranco than La Victoria yeah, but I mean that the houses are like La Victoria. But this is better than Barranco. Way oh. better than Barranco. Okay. And Dublin? No, I never Dublin? Been there. Dublin? Mm -hmm. Sydney? Well, the kangaroo. <laughs> Madrid? Um, no. And Amsterdam? Well, the. the it's a bicycle. bicycle. Yes, everybody goes on bicycle. Oh, yeah. In Amsterdam, in, Amsterdam, in Germany, in many countries, actually, in Europe. Mm -hmm. Many, many countries. Okay, so you don't know anything about them? Mm -hmm. Nothing? <laughs> Me neither. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, in I don't remember the name. Riva, no, 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 you know, I, I, yeah, yeah, but I, I, here, right? yeah, but I, I, it's with Ito, right? It's with Ito. With Ito, with Ito, Ito right? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. It's where Boca, Boca Stadium is there, right? Yeah. Boca Stadium. I went to Boca Stadium. <laughs> I went to the museum. I saw the yeah. stadium and everything. But I don't remember. How <laughs> much? Um, how much time you stay in in this place, this place. for a day? And uh, how long you been there? Four years ago. Mm -hmm. Yeah, four years ago. Four years ago. Okay. I have to wait. <laughs> Number two, look at the guide, match each paragraph with the correct city in exercise one. Okay. Mm. What's what it like to drive around? To, to drive What's around? it like? 
Was it like to drive around? Was it like to Was drive? Was it like to drive around? Very good. It is best to avoid driving into the city center because of the narrow winding streets are and ever expensive parking rates. But if you do, you will need to look out for cyclists and pedestrians. They are everywhere. They always have right of way and they know it. Even local people complain about parking restrictions. It can take up to four years to get a parking permit if you live wow. by one of the famous channels. I think it's absurd though. Yes. I thought it was going I thought it was Buenos Aires, but when they mentioned the canals uh, mm. and Argentina is not that expensive anymore, so mm. two mm, questions. Mm -hmm. There's a local saying nine months of winter and three months of hell. This is not strictly true, but the summer months of July and August tend to be very hot. However, the air is dry and constantly, it doesn't feel as hot as it could be. This heat tends to drive most city dwellers to the coast during the months of August, creating a quiet time of the year in the city. The weather in winter can be very cold, but there are often blue skies and some sunshine, and in general there is not too much rain. I think in Sydney. Mm -hmm. No, Dublin. Are you guessing? No, no. I I choose or Dublin or Sydney. None of them. Oh. Mm -hmm. Okay. I continue reading. <laughs> you can never go wrong with a well pure pork pin of Guinness. 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 In one of the welcoming pubs. Alternatively, it is very chilly day. A glass of traditional whiskey goes down extremely well. There are said to be a thousand pubs in the small capital city, so you never need to be thirsty, to, to be thirsty for long. Uh, Guinness. Guinness. The record Guinness? You can never go wrong with a well pure pint of Guinness. Pint. 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 Pint of Guinness. That's a measurement unit. Yeah. Dublin. Very good. Like the beer. There's a beer called Guinness. Oh. It comes from Dublin. Four. Now here, now here will you find bigger, better users. Safer. Sorry, have you ever been to a um, to a brewery, like a brewery, no, like a little pub where they produce their own beer? Um, no. Are there any breweries uh -uh. here? Here. I don't like beer though, but I think um, it's fun. Like beer. Bacchus, but no, no, no. no uh, uh, like, like a you go to rustic. A you go to a pub and they have uh, like the huge containers where they like chop? they boil no they boil the yeast mm. they boil the barley they do it there no, no never. they process the, the they make the beer there here no no I think no, no? but that's gotta be yeah right? I think the the taste is I don't know better if it, I don't know if it's better but I mean, it's gotta be like more natural. Interesting, right? Like yeah. just to oh, have a beer. Different. Like, uh, for example, in La Paz, there was this place, and uh, they have like hundreds kinds of beer. Mm -hmm. Like it was, it was a borracho's ring. <laughs> yeah, because they have. It like depends, that. because that my borracho ring for wine. That was that place. In Orlando, who has who has uh, a lot of wine? I like wine. I love wine. What kind of wine? Shiraz. Shiraz. It's a type of of, of grape, like 
Non-discolored nel segno. Is it sweet? No. Dry? Yeah, it's dry. Dry. But it, um, the, the color of the shira is in between the next union and rosé. <laughs> so what is it? What color is that? It's, it's not red. A little bit clear than the Verne Sauvignon. So, so light, light red or something? Um, like light red. Bye bye. Hello, oh, Yudi. Uh. <coughs> okay. Okay, let's continue. And four. Now, where will you find bigger, better, juicier, tastier, and more tender steaks? Steaks. Steaks. Remember when we talking about steaks? Steak houses of this elegant city. <coughs> but it is unusual to find that in a city where the majority of people are slim and chic, desserts are very popular. In particular, a sweet substance. Mm -hmm called dulce de leche, a sort of caramel and toffee spread. It's very addictive. Mmm, good one aside. And what do the people do at the weekend? Uh, if you were into music, ballet, or opera, get yourself down to the wonderful, unique opera house. But don't worry if you can get tickets. There are plenty of other places in and around the city to visit. Whatever the, the season. <coughs> in spite of the fact that the city was, was the famous Bondi Beach in summer. Bondi Beach? Thank you. Um, was it here? Was it here? Bondi Beach. In summer, people sit for the south coast, where very white beaches. Coast. 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 Mm -hmm. Where very white beaches, back on the state forest and national park. In winter, the Blue Mountains are the ideal location for some excellent walks and crazy mountain fair. Very good. So you were missing one, right? So the second one is Madrid. Mm -hmm. I'm not uh, is my laundry. Helicopter? No, my laundry. laundry? Your washing machine. My washing machine. What, you have to put out the clothes or what? Hmm? You have to put out the clothes? No. No, no not at least. I think 10 minutes more. Okay. Mm -hmm. mm. Okay, number three, write questions as suitable headings for paragraphs two, three, and four, compared with your partner. Mm -hmm. What is it like to try for now? Look, here you have a question, and the paragraph pretty much is the answer of that question. So you have to find a suitable question for these paragraphs, two, three, and four. For example, um, in number one you have... What's the weather uh, for the second? Uh-huh. Um, how, how is the weather there? Okay, but more particularly, mm. it's about the weather. You're going in the right direction, but <clears throat> what is the main topic here? The the change in according to the season, for example, mm. in are you sure? In July, I don't know. Are you sure? Mm. 
I would say that that should be a question about hot, because they are talking about hot, and in a particular period of time, in a particular season, summer. in summer. So hot and summer are the key words there in your question. So, what would be your question? How is it hot? In how hot? Uh, how hot? Is the summer in there? Does it get in summer? How hot does it get in summer? How? 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 <laughs> how, how hot? 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 Does it get in summer? Does it get in summer? In summer? Okay. And three. You can never go wrong. Three, three. With a well good point of this in one of the most common jobs alternatively. Alternatively? Mm, alternatively. <coughs> it's very cheap to take a glass of traditional whiskey goes to stream of all. Or say to be a thousand pounds in small capital. How is the um, night life in there? Um, Are you sure they are talking about the nightlife? Mm. What is the like main topic? What are they talking? Yes. Like a friend? They are talking about. You've never been to a sea. Because there are so much bar bars or pubs. Mm -hmm. So, mm. what would be your question? What type of um, what type of drinks they drink? <laughs> Very good. What's the best drink in the city? What's the best drink in the city? say that because otherwise they would be mentioning only one item and they mention steaks, desserts and dulce de leche and yes. 
No, no traditional dishes, no? No, I want to find the one. Mm -mm. Mm -hmm. Here I have, where can I find the best steak? But I kind of disagree with that. Okay. Um, why do you think I disagree? Because they mentioned uh, a dessert. Yes, very good. Dessert and dulce de leche and all that, right? So I think some a question that uh, that involves these three things would be. Uh, What do you think would be? Mm, something that. Like, mm, but which is uh, the most touristic food or for tourists? Touristic tour, food. Tour, 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 for tourists. Are you okay? For <laughs> tourism. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm tired. But for tourists, for tourists. Um, I would say something like, where can you find the best food? Okay. Right? Because here it just, where can I find the best steak, right? Mm. But they, they talk about steaks, but it's only one, two lines. Mm -hmm. Not even two lines. <clears throat> okay. Which is the question? Um, where? where can I find the best food? The best steak. The best steak. That's what they mentioned here. But these are possible questions. Mm -hmm. Okay, these are possible questions. So no. your questions could be anything. But I disagree with number four. And I, I just told you the reason because mm -hmm. I love that. I don't like classical music, I like that. Do you know? From Vivaldi, no? Huh? It's from Vivaldi. No. No, no Vivaldi. I'm sure about that. Okay, number four. Match the highlighted words in the guide with the synonyms below. But each is from Lima. Mm. I don't think about that. You know, I haven't had a, a, a beef milanesa yeah. in ages. No? Yeah. A beef. Ah, but I had beef finanesa with you the other day, right? In the in the place. No, here. Here. No, but there is no finanesa. What was it? It's, uh, lentils with lentils. with milanesa, right? Eh? No, no. Yeah. Ah, yeah. But, but cut in in a little pieces. That was uh, that was beef, beef or chicken? No, beef. Okay. Beef. So I had. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, but you you are uh, imagining that the no, because I I just remember Buenos Aires. Mm -hmm. They have like very good milanesas. There. Like milanesas there are beef and with wine. Oh, and with cheese. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> oh no no, I am in <laughs> diet. <laughs> how how do you know? We've never been to Buenos Aires. Because I I um, stay in a place in an Argentina place. In Orlando. Ah, uh, okay. Mm -hmm. Argentinian family? Uh, no, like a restaurant, like a Peruvian food, Argentinian food. Okay. Food. Yeah. okay. Mm -hmm. And I was... Uh, so I was in an Argentinian restaurant? I was in an Argentinian restaurant. Mm -hmm. 
Stay is like stay is like you can stay in a hotel in a house. In a okay, city. I want. Mhm. Mm yeah. <laughs> That's all. <laughs> they are like Milanesa and Napolitana. Have you heard? Ah, with um. With tomatoes. With tomatoes and alva uh, alva basil. 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 Yeah. Mmm, and smell. And cheese. Mmm. No, I am in diet. Oh, I have to but drink. My sure in water. Argentina, you you have the best beef ever. Yeah. Yeah. It's like it's they have the best beef. Yeah, that's the best beef you can get. Like in all the places I've been, the best. I want to go to Iwasu. Mhm. Mm yeah, yeah. And what is that? And how it's, is that? It's really beautiful. I it's really like it was so it one of my three favorite places in South America. Mm -hmm. It was so uh, Machu Picchu and and uh, Uyuni. Right. Uyuni Salar, the the salt uh, the salt lakes. Oh. It's it was um mm -hmm. millions of years ago. In no, that is in Bolivia. What's the name? Uh, Uyuni. Uyuni. Mm -hmm. mm. Bolivia. And it's, it's really, I love it because it looks like the moon. Mm. It's like, it's, it's um, actually it's a salt reservoir. Like mm. they have uh, salt reserves <coughs> there and everything is white. Mm. So at night it looks like the moon, just like the moon, just like oh. the end the moon. So, but it's very cold, uh, very nice. cold, and the houses are made of salt, oh the tables God. are made of salt, the chairs are made of everything, um. the prostitutes are made of salt, no. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> everything is made out of salt, oh my God. the floor, the wall, and where, where is that? In um, Potosí, Potosí. <laughs> <laughs> No, if they say Potosi, you have to say Poto, no. No, <laughs> no por el Poto. <laughs> I, I, I used to tell Bolivians that, and they, they just crack laughing. Yeah. Like, no, when, if you go to Potosi, you tell them no. No por el Poto. <laughs> okay. Why is all about that? Potosí and Titicaca and, and Tarapoto. And Tarapoto. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> because those are uh, Quechua words, I think. But what's the meaning? Are usually. Are usually. Owen to. Oh, I don't understand. Owen to. Yes. Um. Okay.